Oh, that was so good. What's up? It's Kinsey, and today, the day is finally here. It is September 20th. It is the launch day of my podcast, guys. I am so excited. I have wanted to make a podcast for like a very, very, very long time, and I've been working on it probably. When did I decide I was going to do this? Sometime when I was on tour, so in like May or June, and I made the decision, and now. Here we are. Very happy about this. Anyways, the podcast is going to be I Love You So Much with Kinsey Elizabeth. So it's available on Spotify, iTunes, basically anywhere where you guys can listen to a podcast, you can listen to it. So if you guys are watching this, please go and subscribe to the podcast. And if you guys want, go rate it, leave a review. I mean, like, listen to an episode or something. Leave an honest review, a nice one. By honest, I mean, like, you love me. Remember that. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, no, but I'm so excited for this, guys. We're going to be posting a podcast. Do you post? No, you don't post a podcast. Really trying to get out of my YouTube lingo. We're going to be uploading a podcast every single Thursday. Originally, I was recording them in my office, and I recorded a ton this summer. But then I signed with Dear Media, so now I go into a studio and record. It's literally how I wanted my podcast to be like a year or two from now. It's like started off that way before it even launched. It's so cool. So there's like a producer and everything. Like it's a big thing. It's a big I mean, yeah, it is in my mind. So I am so, so, so happy if you guys can't tell. Oh, my first guest is Alicia. Alicia did record her podcast here. Uh, normally they are recorded in the studio, but because of that, I got to film a little bit of it. So you guys are able to see kind of like what, I mean, you're not gonna see the podcast normally, it's gonna be audio, you know? But I'm gonna show you guys like a little bit of that so you guys can kind of see, get a feel. Basically, each episode has one guest and then one like loose topic. I don't want to say one loose topic. We just like, we talk about a lot of things. So like Alicia's burnout, Remy's gonna be on, Chris Clemens is on, a bunch of YouTubers, a lot of other like really cool people. My director from school is on to do a leadership podcast, which I'm so excited for. Obviously, Danielle's gonna be on it, Morgan's on it, like so many of my friends and more people. So if you guys have any ideas on who you guys want me to have on the podcast, just leave them down below or like tweet us, tag us. That's better for me if you just like tag us in it and then we're both tagged in it so I don't think I'm crazy, you know? Yeah, so I'm going to be posting way more of my podcast on my Instagram. So if you guys want, you guys can go follow it. Guys, I'm literally so excited. I don't even, I'm just like, I'm so excited. I could cry. I might cry. You know, this is pre filmed so the day it uploads, I might actually cry. Anyways, if you guys post anything about the podcast, please post it with the hashtag ILYSM with Kenzie Elizabeth. That's the hashtag I'm going to be checking out. Follow my Twitter, my Instagram. Let me know what guests you guys want to have on. I hope you guys enjoy this little portion of the podcast with Alicia. And if you guys want to hear the full episode, it'll be linked down below. Subscribe um, to my channel and the podcast. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I'm so excited for this. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye. Yay. I just realized I say I love you so much at the end of my, all my videos. It's perfect. Perfect. It's perfect. I love it. I love it. What would you tattoo to your body? Oh, oh my god. I know. I know. Yeah. I know. I know. Oh my god. I'm obsessed with the whole like under boob tattoo. Oh, but I would never true. do that. I think it's yeah. so, like Rihanna's is so cool. Yeah, but like. literally fell out. <laughs> whatever. Um, yeah. But I, I don't think I could ever. Like I'm not opposed to tattoos. I would totally get one. But that's Don't cool. you have one? I don't. I almost did. It didn't work out. That's right. I remember it now. I remember the vlog. There was something like that. Yeah. Okay. Wait, isn't it? Wasn't it like the like apostrophe? No, apostrophe. It wasn't. It was, it was a. It was a cross, but it had a dash with it. Because it was in between, like, in between, in between the years that you know. Yeah. Like that. I right. I love stuff with meaning. So yeah, I but I overthink everything. So. Yeah. I don't really. I have one that says Texas when I have a star for my cousin. I, I really love that. Who's your celebrity crush? Mm. 
We all love a good KJ Appa. Yeah. We all love. As of recent, it's Justin Timberlake. That's really, really good. Though. Yeah, but all of a sudden, random. I love that though. All of a sudden, I'm like, he's so hot. So I'm like, in for that, <laughs> I actually you know? love that. And he's also like out of our age range to where like yeah. I don't feel like I'm ever gonna accidentally run into him somewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're like, oh, Justin, are you so like, this? So I can <laughs> say it and like not be like, oh my gosh, I hope that this never had like something horrible does not oh, happen. No, no, I love that. Today's episode, we're gonna focus a little bit on burnout. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we're talking to great <laughs> Alicia and I have been talking about this topic since way before you when took your break. Start, though. When did we start hanging out like weekly? Um, because I was trying to figure that out with Taylor, and I think it was was it earlier this year or later la last year? It was probably later last year. Was I doing Vlogmas? That's how I can tell everything. Maybe. Like, was I filming Vlogmas? I think we were definitely hanging out during Vlogmas, but I think that um, I think that we started doing our weekly Wait, thing. Like January. January because okay. it was right before I moved into this house because we were sitting at the yes. house and I was like I want to live here and then literally found the and house when next you move? week February oh my god okay so it was January so it was definitely January oh my god yeah no that was um yeah we've talked about burnout and just YouTube for so long Yes, Alicia's like my big YouTube sister. I go to her for I all love my that advice. So much. Anything Literally. that Alicia says, I do. I love helping. <laughs> uh, no, yeah. So I feel like you, you probably saw it coming more than some people of the most yeah. part of just like me needing a break, break and feeling burnout and stuff. Um, and you'd already taken a break too. Like yeah, a oh break. my god, you I did. I took a week break. Yeah, oh my god, me. I'm like taking a week break as if that's anything. Well, the thing with that though, I was thinking about that I after that. the fact. A week break on YouTube isn't really even a break. You still have to pre film for the next week. Because you still have to be working for the next week. Yeah, so it's really not even a break. In order to oh take a break on YouTube, it's got to be a substantial period of time. I actually genuinely forgot about that. I, yeah, I tried taking a break, and in my head I was like, oh, this is enough. Like it doesn't matter. That's that's all I need. I'm good for another year. Yeah. And when was that? January, February, March, April, May. Four months later. Yeah. When did you like to know? Break. Did you have, if you guys I don't know, Alicia took a break from her channel, what was it? Two it, months? It was ago? a two month. It was a two, yeah. yeah. She came back this week that we we're filming it. I did. But it's, it, you're, you're listening to this like a month later. It's so, okay, okay. Um, yeah, when did you like know that you needed to? Like, what was your turning point? Because this is also really, like, Alicia is like, very dedicated, so for her to take a break, it's a huge yeah. deal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, no, I feel like I can be a workaholic to where it's almost unhealthy, so yes. me taking a step back. It was honestly, and this is, not many people know how it came about. Mm -hmm. I just remember feeling so stressed, and even recently, well, about, like three weeks ago, I had a doctor like just check up and long story short, like my stress levels were so high that like my cortisol was off and everything. And, I, and she was like, are you stressed a lot? And I was just like, yeah, maybe. <laughs> but, um, but anyways, um, so it was honestly kind of spontaneous in the sense of it. I didn't know till honestly right before I filmed that video. Um, I remember having a full on breakdown, which at that time happened pretty regularly. Mm -hmm. So I knew, oh, once I have a break, like I'll have a breakdown, I'll feel better afterwards, it's okay. And I remember I was with my sister, we were at Sweet Green and we were talking and just catching up and I started venting. And the second, and this is such a movie moment, I physically couldn't get the words out of my mouth saying, I think I need to take a break. By the time I finally get that out of my mouth, I like had a full on panic attack in Sweet Green. Had to go to the car and start bawling my eyes out. And it was just like me having to say it out loud was so hard. But when I finally got it out and seeing my response to that showed me, okay, I think I actually do need to take a break. Mm -hmm. um, so then it was weird timing because I just remember thinking, okay, if I'm gonna take a break, the businesswoman side of me, like <laughs> this is so me, honestly, as you'd laugh. The business side of me was thinking, okay, if I'm taking a break, I actually should announce it for this week's video because I don't have a video for this week, which was half of the stress and stuff of trying to keep up. And summer and back to school and just like that time on YouTube is big and big on my channel. Like that's the biggest time for my channel. So it makes sense if I'm going to take a break to take it in May so I can take a month off and come back for the biggest time on my channel. Um, so I think I filmed the break video maybe two, three days after I had my breakdown and 
it felt weird. It felt really yeah. weird, and I put it up that Sunday. So it was very quick, but I think it was a long time coming. Yeah, I think it was definitely needed. How like how how did it feel when you actually took a step back? Because you you stopped, but you didn't <laughs> no, really, like, didn't. you know. Yeah. Um, well, speaking back to that workaholic side of me, I dove into Instagram. And what I said in my main channel video was, I'm not gonna be gone from all socials, it's just a break for my main channel. Didn't realize it ended up being a break for my vlog channel too for about three weeks. Mm -hmm.